So you're sitting there, all excited to play your favorite game on your brand new PS5, and suddenly you're hit with an error code. CE117740-0. What does that even mean? Well, don't worry, because today I'm going to show you how to fix this pesky error and get back to gaming in no time. First things first, let's understand what this error code actually signifies. CE11774-0 usually indicates a problem with the application you're trying to run on your PS5. It could be a compatibility issue, a corrupted file, or even a problem with the system software itself. But fear not, because we're going to troubleshoot it step by step. The first thing you should try is restarting your console. Yes, it may sound cliche, but sometimes a simple reboot can do wonders. So go ahead, turn off your PS5, unplug it from the power source, wait for a few minutes, and then plug it back in. Power it on and see if the error code still persists. If the error code is still haunting you, it's time to move on to the next step. Check for any available system updates. Sony regularly releases updates to fix bugs and improve system performance. So head over to the settings menu, select system software update, and let your PS5 search for any available updates. If there's an update waiting for you, download and install it, and then restart your console once again. Now, if the error code is still stubbornly sticking around, it's time to dive a little deeper. Check if the application you're trying to run is up to date. Developers often release patches and updates for their games to address any issues. So make sure you have the latest version of the game installed. If not, update it and give it another shot. If none of these steps have resolved the issue, it's time to consider the possibility of a corrupted file. Sometimes a file within the application can get corrupted, causing the error code to appear. In this case, you may need to delete and reinstall the application. But before you do that, make sure to back up any game saves or important data, as reinstalling the application will erase all of that. And finally, if all else fails, it's time to reach out to Sony's customer support. They have a team of experts who can guide you through the troubleshooting process and provide further